Hey there, everybody. Good morning. Welcome to a brand new week. Today is Monday, July the 30th. Can you believe it already? July is almost gone. Man, time rips right on by, doesn't it? Good morning, Joe. Good morning, Vicky. Listen, if you'd like to get your name Shout it out. All you got to do is do what these guys just did. Leave a comment down there. Say good morning, Cliff. Good morning to you, sir. So happy to see you here this morning. Also, whether you're watching live or on the replay, doesn't matter. Go ahead and leave a comment down there. Say hi. Say good morning. Whatever strikes your fancy. If you got a question, comment, topic you'd like for me to hit, you can leave those down there as well. I would suggest to you to grab a cup of coffee, but then you'd have to leave the show. You should bring a cup of coffee. Yeah, that's it. Bring a cup of coffee. And by the way, if you happen to be listening on your favorite podcast catcher, iTunes, TuneIn, Stitcher, um, any of the above, all of the above, SoundCloud, or watching on YouTube for that matter, uh, don't forget to head over to 7minutesinthemorning.com and um, join the conversation that's going on here. Brad, good morning to you. Aisha, good morning you as well man great group forming up here this morning our topic for today and i i i I might say this week (coughs) excuse me but i'm not not sure how long i'll go on this we'll we'll just see where it takes us topic for today are you winning are you winning and then of course the follow-on question that comes from your coach how do you know Oh, it just got a lot more difficult, didn't it? This, it's an interesting question that, um, I actually, I was sitting in on a, uh, on a staff meeting with a CEO one time and he asked, this is the question that he asked. And I thought, man, what, what a brilliant question, right? Are we winning? And because everybody wants to talk about stuff. And what I'm doing and how many phone calls we've made and how many new clients we've landed and how close we are on this one and why we're delayed on that one. Are we winning? I can hear my assistant coming down the hall. Are you winning? And if you don't know the answer to that question, it's okay. Most people don't know, but now you know to ask the question. And so I want to talk, um, that, that's what I want to talk about today. How do you know, right, is, is perhaps even more important than whether you're winning or not. Because it goes to how you measure what's important. You know, we talk here a lot about understand, <clears throat> understanding the outcome that you want to create using the outcome as a filter to help you make decisions about what to focus on, what to spend time on. You can only have one priority. We talked about time and and managing our use of time all week last week, right? But just because we're really good at managing how we spend our time still doesn't mean that we're working on the right things. Right. So what I want you to think about today, uh, we might even get a short show in today just because this is going to leave you time for homework. Ah, yeah, that's what we'll do. I'll leave you time for homework. I want you to think about those two questions. Are you winning? And just, you know, here's what's your gut response to that? If we were sitting across the table right now and, and I said, are you winning in this in this effort that you are pursuing? Are you winning? How would you answer that? And the coach in me is going to say, I will accept one of three answers. (laughs) And well, not, no, kind of, no, that, that answer won't work. Yes, no, or I don't know. Yes, no, or I don't know. And if you don't know, it's okay. It's much better to say I don't know than to say yes and you're really not. It's okay. So that's question number one, are you winning? Question number two, 
How do you know? Regardless of what the answer was. If you said yes, how do you know you're winning? If you said no, how do you know you're losing? If you said, I don't know, we need to work on that. Or, and that will be our topic for tomorrow. So be sure and uh, join me again tomorrow. We'll hit the topic, how to answer, how to fix your answer, if you don't know whether you're winning or losing. All right? But that's what I want you to take away from today. you got a few minutes to do the homework here. I left you some time. Are you winning? How do you know? And if you're super brave, I want to say this. Yeah. If you're super brave, leave them in the comments. Let everybody know. Look, here's the thing, right? Um, what's the stat? That if, if one person is thinking, if one person asks the question and three to seven people have the question, you, you know, share and, and and help one another. I, I mean, I did a um, an engage class, the Catalyst on Friday. And one of the things that I told them, I tell, I try to tell them all the time, the people around this table will become, can become the most helpful people in your business because they're the only ones. Yeah, they're they're the ones who see things the same way you do. A lot of the people that you run with, that you hang with, that you talk to all the time, they think you're crazy. Right. But the people here, we know what it's like. We're here to help. So if you feel brave, you want to, you, you, you want to lead the pack, put your comment out there. Let us know. Are you winning? And how do you know? What are, what are the measures you use? What are the questions you ask every day, every week to tell whether you're winning or not? All right. That's it for today. Going to go ahead and wrap it up. I'll be back here to figure out, help you figure out how you can know. If you're unsure, we'll figure that out tomorrow. At 7 o'clock, with a new installment of 7 Minutes in the Morning, you guys be sure and be here. And uh, I'll talk to you then. You have a magnificent, what is today, Monday? Talk to you in the morning.